The Kumov K-26 is a Soviet light multipurpose helicopter distinguished by its coaxial rotor system and an unconventional modular design. It was developed by the Kumov Design Bureau under the leadership of Nikolai Ilyich Kumov in the early 1960s with the goal of creating a specialized and highly efficient aircraft for civilian use, primarily in agriculture and transport. Design work began in 1962, and the concept was based on a flying chassis. Instead of a traditional fuselage, the Ka-26 consists of a fixed cockpit for a two-person crew and a central platform located at the helicopter's center of gravity. Various removable modules could be attached to this platform, including a passenger cabin, cargo platform, medical module, agricultural tanks, or rescue equipment. Reconfiguration between roles required only 1.5 to 2 hours and did not demand complex rebalancing, which was a major operational advantage. The K-26 made its first flight in August 1965 and entered serial production in 1969. More than 800 helicopters were built, mainly at the Kumertau Aviation Production Plant. It became the only helicopter in the USSR designed almost exclusively for peaceful civilian tasks without strict military requirements shaping its design. The helicopter uses a coaxial rotor system with two three-bladed rotors rotating in opposite directions. This eliminated the need for a tail rotor and provided compact dimensions, excellent maneuverability, and symmetrical airflow. Power is supplied by two Vadeniev M14V 26 nine-cylinder air-cooled radial piston engines, each producing about 325 horsepower, mounted in side nacelles. This configuration improved safety as the helicopter could continue flight after the failure of one engine. One of the K-26's most notable strengths was its performance in agricultural aviation. The coaxial rotors created a gentle and uniform downwash, allowing pesticides to remain suspended longer and settle beneath leaves, increasing effectiveness while reducing damage to crops. The helicopter was widely used for crop dusting, vineyard spraying, forest patrol, and external load operations. The KA-26 was also used as a transport, air ambulance, flying crane, patrol helicopter, and ship-based rescue platform. Its fiberglass rotor blades had an exceptionally long service life, exceeding 5,000 flight hours, and were patented internationally. The helicopter received certification under American airworthiness standards, a rare achievement for a Soviet aircraft. The Ka-26 set five world aviation records and was exported to more than 15 countries, operating on all continents. Its design later evolved into the Ka-126 with a single turboshaft engine and the Ka-226 with two turboshaft engines. Even decades after its introduction, the Kamov Ka-26 remains a remarkable example of Soviet engineering, valued for its modularity, reliability, and efficiency in demanding low-altitude operations.